In mathematics, a line integral is an integral where the function to be integrated is evaluated along a curve. The terms path integral, curve integral, and curvilinear integral are also used, contour integral as well, although that is typically reserved for line integrals in the complex plane. The function to be integrated may be a scalar field or a vector field. The value of the line integral is the sum of values of the field at all points on the curve, weighted by some scalar function on the curve commonly arc length or, for a vector field, the scalar product of the vector field with a differential vector in the curve. This weighting distinguishes the line integral from simpler integrals defined on intervals. Many simple formulae in physics for example, w. Topic. Fs have natural continuous analogs in terms of line integrals w. CFDS. The line integral finds the work done on an object moving through an electric or gravitational field, for example. Topic. Vector calculus In qualitative terms, a line integral in vector calculus can be thought of as a measure of the total effect of a given tensor field along a given curve. For example, the line integral over a scalar field rank zero tensor can be interpreted as the area under the field carved out by a particular curve. This can be visualized as the surface created by z equals f x y and a curve c in the x y plane. The line integral of f would be the area of the curtain created when the points of the surface that are directly over c are carved out. Equals. <laughs> Topic: Line integral of a scalar field. Equals. Topic: Definition. For some scalar field F U R N R Display style F Math BB U subsetec Math BB R carrot N right arrow Math BB R The line integral along a piecewise smooth curve C U Display style math call c subset math b b u is defined as c f r d s equals a b f r t r t d t Display style int underscore math call C F Math BF R D S equals int underscore a carrot B F left Math BF R T right Math BF R T D T Where R A B C Display style Math BF R A B right arrow Math call C is an arbitrary bijective parametrization of the curve C display style Math call C such that R A display style Math BF R A and R B display style Math BF R B give the endpoints of C display style Math call C and A B display style A here, and in the rest of the article, the absolute value bars denote the standard Euclidean norm of a vector. The function f is called the integrand, the curve c is the domain of integration, and the symbol ds may be intuitively interpreted as an elementary arc length. Line integrals of scalar fields over a curve c Display style math call C do not depend on the chosen parametrization R display style math BF R of C display style math call C geometrically when the scalar field F display style F 
is defined over a plane n equals 2 display style n equals 2 its graph is a surface z equals f x y display style z equals f x y in space, and the line integral gives the signed cross-sectional area bounded by the curve C. Display style math call C. And the graph of F. Display style F. See the animation to the right. Topic derivation. For a line integral over a scalar field, the integral can be constructed from a Riemann sum using the above definitions of f, c and a parametrization r of c. This can be done by partitioning the interval a, b into n sub-intervals t i1, t of length delta t equals b minus a, n, then r t denotes some point, call it a sample point, on the curve c we can use the set of sample points r t, 1 i n to approximate the curve c by a polygonal path by introducing a straight line piece between each of the sample points r t i1 and r t. We then label the distance between each of the sample points on the curve as delta c. The product of f r t and delta c can be associated with the signed area of a rectangle with a height and width of f r t and delta c respectively. Taking the limit of the sum of the terms as the length of the partitions approaches zero gives us i equals lim delta s I zero I equals one N F R T I Delta S I Display style i equals lim underscore delta s underscore i right arrow zero sum underscore i equals one caret n f math b f r t underscore i delta s underscore i. We note that by the mean value theorem, the distance between subsequent points on the curve is delta s i equals r T I plus delta T minus R T I approximately equals R T I delta T Display style delta s underscore i equals math bf r t underscore i plus delta t math bf r t underscore i approximately math bf r t underscore i delta t. Substituting this in the above Riemann sum yields i equals lim delta t zero I equals one N F R T I R T I Delta T Display style i equals lim underscore delta t right arrow zero sum underscore i equals one caret n f math b f r t underscore i math b f r t underscore i delta t, which is the Riemann sum for the integral i equals a b f r t r T D T Display style I equals int underscore a carrot B F Math B F R T Math B F R T D T Topic 
line integral of a vector field topic definition For a vector field f, u r n r n, the line integral along a piecewise smooth curve c u, in the direction of r, is defined as c f r d r equals a b f r t r t D T Display style int underscore C Math BF F Math BF R C D O T D Math BF R equals int underscore a carrot B Math BF F Math BF R T C D O T Math BF R T D T where is the dot product and R, A, B, C is a bijective parametrization of the curve C such that R, A, and R, B give the endpoints of C. A line integral of a scalar field is thus a line integral of a vector field where the vectors are always tangential to the line. Line integrals of vector fields are independent of the parametrization R in absolute value, but they do depend on its orientation. Specifically, a reversal in the orientation of the parametrization changes the sign of the line integral. From the viewpoint of differential geometry, the line integral of a vector field along a curve is the integral of the corresponding one form under the musical isomorphism which takes the vector field to the corresponding covector field over the curve considered as an immersed one-manifold. Topic. Derivation The line integral of a vector field can be derived in a manner very similar to the case of a scalar field, but this time with the inclusion of a dot product. Again using the above definitions of f, c and its parametrization r, t, we construct the integral from a Riemann sum. We partition the interval a, b, which is the range of the values of the parameter t into n intervals of length delta t equals b minus a, n. Letting t be the ith point on a, b, then r t gives us the position of the ith point on the curve. However, instead of calculating up the distances between subsequent points, we need to calculate their displacement vectors, delta re. As before, evaluating f at all the points on the curve and taking the dot product with each displacement vector gives us the infinitesimal contribution of each partition of f on c. Letting the size of the partitions go to zero gives us a sum i equals lim delta t zero i equals one n f r t i delta r i display style i equals lim underscore delta t right arrow zero sum underscore i equals one caret n math b f f math b f r t underscore i c d o t delta math b f r underscore i by the mean value theorem, we see that the displacement vector between adjacent points on the curve is delta r i equals r t i plus delta t minus r t i approximately equals r t i delta t display style delta math bf r underscore i equals math bf r t underscore i plus delta t math bf r t underscore i approximately math bf r t underscore i delta t Substituting this in the above Riemann sum yields I 
equals lim delta t zero i equals one n f r t i r t i delta t Display style i equals lim underscore delta t right arrow zero sum underscore i equals one caret n math bf f math bf r t underscore i c d o t math bf r t underscore i delta t, which is the Riemann sum for the integral defined above. Topic: Path independence. If a vector field f is the gradient of a scalar field g i.e. if f is conservative, that is g equals f display style nabla g equals math bf f then the derivative of the composition of g and r t is d g r t d T equals G R T R T equals F R T R T Display style frac d g math b f r t d t equals nabla g math b f r t c d o t math b f r t equals math b f f math b f r t c d o t math b f r t, which happens to be the integrand for the line integral of f on r t. It follows, given a path c, that c f R D R equals A B F R T R T D T equals A B D G R T D T D T equals G R B minus G R A Display style int underscore C Math BF F Math BF R C D O T D Math BF R equals int underscore a carrot B Math BF F Math BF R T C D O T Math BF R T D T equals int underscore a carrot B frac D G Math BF R T D T D T equals G Math BF R B G Math BF F R A. In other words, the integral of f over c depends solely on the values of g at the points r b and r a, and is thus independent of the path between them. For this reason, a line integral of a conservative vector field is called path independent. Topic: <laughs> Applications. The line integral has many uses in physics. For example, the work done on a particle traveling on a curve C inside a force field represented as a vector field F is the line integral of F on C. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Flow across a curve. For a vector field F, U R two R two, such as F x y equals p x y q x y 
display style f x y equals p x y q x y the line integral across a piecewise smooth curve cu is defined as c f r d r t equals a b minus q x y d x plus p x y d y equals a b p r t q r t r 2 t minus r 1 t d t Display style int underscore C Math BF F Math BF R C D O T D Math BF R carrot T equals int underscore a carrot B Q X Y D X plus P X Y die equals int underscore a carrot B P Math BF R T Q Math BF R T C D O T R underscore two T R underscore one T D T where is the dot product in R, A, B, C, R, T equals R, 1, T, R, 2, T. Display style R, T equals R underscore 1, T, R underscore 2, T is a bijective parametrization of the curve C such that R A and R B give the endpoints of C. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Complex line integral. In complex analysis, the line integral is defined in terms of multiplication and addition of complex numbers. Suppose u is an open subset of the complex plane C, f, u C as a function, and L u subset u is a curve of finite length, parametrized by gamma A B L displaystyle gamma A B to L where gamma T equals X T plus I Y T display style gamma T equals X T plus E T the line integral L F Z D Z Display style int underscore L F Z D Z may be defined by subdividing the interval A B into a topic T zero B and considering the expression K equals one N F gamma T K gamma T K minus gamma T K minus one equals K equals one N F gamma K delta gamma K display style sum underscore K equals one carrot N F gamma T underscore K gamma T underscore K gamma T underscore K one equals sum underscore K equals one carrot N F gamma underscore K delta gamma underscore K the integral is then the limit of this Riemann sum as the lengths of the subdivision intervals approach zero if the parametrization gamma display style gamma is continuously differentiable the line integral can be evaluated as an integral of a function of a real variable L F Z D Z equals A B F 
gamma t gamma t d t display style int underscore l f z d z equals int underscore a caret b f gamma t gamma t d t when l display style l is a closed curve that is its initial and final points coincide the notation l f z d z display style point underscore l f z d z is often used for the line integral of f along l display style l a closed curve line integral is sometimes referred to as a cyclic integral in engineering applications. The line integral with respect to the conjugate complex differential d z display style overline d z is defined to be l f d z equals L F D Z equals A B F Gamma T Gamma T D T Display style int underscore L F overline D Z equals overline int underscore L overline F D Z equals int underscore a carrot B F gamma T overline gamma T D T. The line integrals of complex functions can be evaluated using a number of techniques. The integral may be split into real and imaginary parts, reducing the problem to that of evaluating two real valued line integrals. The Cauchy integral formula may be used in other circumstances. If the line integral is a closed curve in a region where the function is analytic and containing no singularities, then the value of the integral is simply zero. This is a consequence of the Cauchy integral theorem. The residue theorem allows contour integrals to be used in the complex plane to find integrals of real valued functions of a real variable. See residue theorem for an example. Topic. Example Consider the function f z equals 1, z, and let the contour L be the unit circle about 0, parametrized by z t equals e i t with t in 0, 2 pi which generates the circle counterclockwise. Substituting, we find L f z d Z equals zero two pi one E I T I E I T D T equals I zero two Pi E minus I T E I T D T equals I zero two Pi D T equals I two Pi minus zero equals two Pi I Display style begin aligned point underscore L F Z D Z and equals int underscore zero carrot two pi one over E carrot it I E carrot it D T equals I int underscore zero carrot two pi E carrot it E carrot it D T and equals I int underscore zero carrot two pi D T equals I two pi minus zero equals two pi I end aligned here we have used the fact that any complex complex number z can be written as right where r is the modulus of z. On the unit circle this is fixed to 1, so the only variable left is the angle, which is denoted by t. 
This answer can be also verified by Cauchy's integral formula. Topic: <laughs> Relation between the line integral of a vector field and the complex line integral. Viewing complex numbers as two-dimensional vectors, the line integral of a two-dimensional vector field corresponds to the real part of the line integral of the conjugate of the corresponding complex function of a complex variable. More specifically, if R T equals X T Y T Display style math BF R T equals X T Y T is a parameterization of L and F Z equals U Z plus I V Z Display style F Z equals U Z plus four Z then L F Z D Z equals L F D X plus I L F D Y equals L U V D R plus I L minus V U D R Display style int underscore L overline F Z D Z equals int underscore L bar F D X plus I int underscore L bar F di equals int underscore L U V C D O T D Math B F R plus I int underscore L V U C D O T D Math B F R provided that both integrals on the right hand side exist and that the parametrization gamma display style gamma of l has the same orientation as r display style math bf r just expand the riemann sum for the left hand integral and take the limit by green's theorem the area of a region enclosed by a smooth closed positively oriented curve l display style l is given by the integral 1 2 i l z d z display style frac 1 2 i int underscore l overline z d z this fact is used for example in the proof of the area theorem Due to the cauchy riemann equations the curl of the vector field corresponding to the conjugate of a holomorphic function is zero. This relates through Stokes' theorem both types of line integral being zero. Topic. Quantum mechanics The path integral formulation of quantum mechanics actually refers not to path integrals in this sense but to functional integrals, that is, integrals over a space of paths, of a function of a possible path. However, path integrals in the sense of this article are important in quantum mechanics, for example, complex contour integration is often used in evaluating probability amplitudes in quantum scattering theory equals equals see also